Hello Airsofters, welcome back to the Pittsburgh Area Airsoft. Today we're going to review the Echo One JP54 or ASR Advanced Sniper Rifle. Now, it may look like here that Echo One ripped me off and I feel like a total douchebag, but the thing is, I don't look like a total douchebag because I have the sniper rifle and they don't, because I paid them to give me this. So, they're jealous that they don't have this sexy sniper rifle. Alright. It's model I don't even know if there's a real gun like this. I didn't study it. I'm not like those other guys. But, there's a few different, there's a few models that, that look like this. And this scope is not included. Sucks for you guys. Buy your own. I bought my own. So, you're no different. But, if you if you really want to know, this is a 40 by 40 Swiss Arms scope, single zoom. It's got pretty good range, and this gun itself is very accurate. Like a cool thing about this, this is for you lefties. Like, I'm gonna pull this back. You see right here, there's a it's like it's for the bolt. It comes with a oh since when I got it, which was about a few weeks ago. It comes with the left-handed bolt adapter, which I'm not going to show you right now. It also comes with a counterclockwise 14-inch thread adapter. I mean, 14 millimeter, whatever. And it comes with this blunt unjamming rod, which I usually whip people with. It comes with this very unusual speed loader, which you probably have something like this. But it's for these type of sniper rifle mags, you probably have one if you have like a UTG L96 or something, or a Bar 10 standard mag. It's plastic though. Yeah, plastic. But it, the spring lights get stiff and it'll misfire the gun sometimes, but that's okay because this gun is sexy and awesome. It comes with this removable bipod. It's, you can fold it up. I'm just going to get it folded. And you can snap it back on. It extends about another two inches and go back on. I'm just going to snap that back on and it's got an LE stock. Put the bolt back so I don't fuck it up. LE stock standard. You have one if you have an M4 or something like that. It's wobbly like every other LE stock and you can buy one if you're not cheap. And excuse my fucking dogs, because they are douchebags. What was we doing that? I'm sorry, because there's people here. And we, do, we do not like people. We really do not like people. So, back to the gun. Um, the magazine well is up here in the handguard, you stupid fucking dog. And it goes like this. There's no magazine release. The magazine releases on the mag. Snaps out. It doesn't jam too much. And this was not loaded. This one is, but this one isn't. Comes with three of these mags out of the box. It shoots really nice out of the box. About three, no, 480 FPS. But it also comes with two Allen wrenches, so you can adjust the hop up right in front of the mag well. And for various other pick screws around the body of the gun. The bipod's a little wobbly. I probably should have covered this when I covered the bipod. And my dog better shut the fuck up. But it's wobbly. It shouldn't affect you too much. If you don't mind it, I don't. It's got a sling mount back here. All all there. All LE stocks do, but there's no sling mount up here, so if you want a sling, then you have to buy a sling mount. It's got a thin pistol grip, which is really nice. Realistic feel. And, uh... And then... Yeah, it, the bolt's really nice. Comes back pretty smooth. But the thing here... When you... If you do switch the bolt, if you are unlucky enough to be left-handed, then there's a pin in here. You probably can't see it. Because I modified it so it doesn't come out. So, like, if you 
don't put this down, like don't pull the bolt down when it's in the back position because then the little pin will pop out and you can't shoot the gun anymore because it will only stay like this and you cannot shoot the gun like this. The safety is right behind the bolt. It's a two-stage safety, back is fire, forward is safe. Yeah, so uh, it's got a, I want to say about a four inch rail. Yeah, on top of the gun, so you can mount your favorite optic, or how they would say it. So we're gonna load it, and we are going to shoot it. But uh, part two. yeah, we'll make a part two video where we shoot it because there's people here, and we do not like people. Well, we do, but there's only certain people we like. Some.